Hey what's up guys, KSK here. Welcome back to this video. This is a quick overview of Kali Linux 2021. Now in this video, I'm going to talk about everything of Kali Linux 2021. So make sure to watch the video until the end without missing anything. And don't forget to subscribe to this channel and consider clicking the bell button to get notified. Let's get started. So what's new in Kali Linux 2021.1? Let's start with desktop environment. Compared to the previous versions of Kali Linux, this update comes with a slightly improved user interface. The all-new Kali Linux ships with KDE Plasma 5.20.5 which comes with a few bug fixes and UI improvements. It looks more responsive and natural and handles all the inputs quicker and gives any response instantaneously. The default themes on KDE Plasma have been tweaked a little bit to adapt the natural environment of Kali Linux. Also, XFCE, the default desktop environment that shifts with Kali Linux has also been tweaked a little bit to make it more unique and gives a true flavor of Kali Linux. The GTK theme on XFCE looks like this and have added a few changes to the system UI controls. Most of the time we spend using terminal inside Kali Linux. Each terminal that ships with Kali are different from the other. The terminal that ships on both XFCE and KDE Plasma have been tweaked to make it more look alike a Kali version. Inside the terminal, whenever typing any command that is not installed within the system will end up showing this output. This is very irritating for some users. Now sometimes we end up typing an incorrect name of the command or trying to access a command that was installed and your system ends up showing the command not found. Well, Kali Linux 2021.1 brings an intelligent suggestion to the terminal that enables to find the command to install if not found. For example, if I type htop and pressing the return key will display this message and check this out, it even provides the right way to install the command with the help of powerful suggestions. This is an amazing feature to have in Linux. For beginners, it could be a very friendly for them. Kali Linux team has collaborated with many developers who made a great tools and have added them to the system by default. This is the new list of the all new tools that have been integrated into this brand new update. The development build of Ubuntu 2021 was recently featured with Kernel 5.10 LTS. It seems like all of the Linux distros are sticking to the Kernel 5.10 LTS instead of Kernel 5.11. This kernel brings a significant performance improvement to the BTRFS file system as well as to the I.O. operations. Also, the XFAT file system has got a major write performance boost. And these are some of the features that Kernel 5.10 LTS supports. Now the other features of Kali Linux 2021 include a newer boot animation for Kali NetHunter, a preliminary support for Kali ARM for Parallels and Apple Silicon and more. That's it guys, these are some of the new features of Kali Linux 2021. This update doesn't bring a more changes in terms of user interface, it's just a small minor release. So what do you guys think about it? Let me know in the comment section down below. Thanks for watching this video, it's been KS I'll catch you in my next one. Peace.